okay, I gotta get through this time. I gotta get through. Okay, come on. Okay, okay. Last time. Okay, you can do this. CDC 19th unit, how may we help you today? Well, hi. Uh, uh, I, I wasn't expecting to get through. Uh, um, I, Sir, I believe I have a cure. If you're calling the general hotline, <laughs> it's not that simple. No, obviously it's not that simple. But you see, we've taken the MRVL 8133 existing vaccine and combined it with the antibodies found in a goblin shark's red blood cells. And I believe with the centrifugal... Let me stop you right there. <laughs> Okay, look. Look, you're just a front desk worker. I need you to put me through to somebody that I can explain this so we can get the cure. But at this point, our government <laughs> has put billions of dollars into other reputable companies with doctors. PhDs. Okay, yes, yes. But where has that gotten us? Obviously, there's uh, other resources, but the government... <coughs> Sir, we don't need to waste your time. No, no, but there's... You're not, I'm not wasting, I'm not wasting your time. <coughs> no, okay, come on. Stay on the line. Just give me that. <coughs> It's May 18th, I'm in the lab office. I finally reached a point in my research where I have something to go off into a procedure that I think will work to synthesize a cure for the virus. It's the morning of May 19th. <coughs> Here we have the malaria vaccine, as well as the goblin blood antibodies. When we combine these, this is what creates what I believe is the cure for this virus. All right, as I pour the one in, you can see we have this green serum. <coughs> We still need to find a way to homogenize and mix, and this is what we're working on next. It's May 21st, here in the lab office, and my team has finally synthesized a homogenous mixture that we believe will work as the cure. Uh, we're still working on a way to administer it. Uh, we're trying to look at some sort of endothermic reaction to create a vapor to just inhale. This is about enough for about, <coughs> about 100 patients. I'm sorry, give me a second here. We can manufacture this stuff in about 45 minutes. It's still going to need a couple days because we need to test it more. <coughs> but this is what we've got so far. I hope that's great. <coughs> I'm going to have to end that. <coughs> <coughs> the day won't matter much longer. I'm taking a turn for the worst. <coughs> we still don't even know if we've perfected the cure. We can't figure it out. <coughs> I don't know how much. <coughs> Oh god damn it! I can't <coughs> <coughs> If I do this right, just a little bit, then the heat from my hand should be enough to make this work here. My God, this is the best I felt in days, weeks. You know, this is the best I felt in years. Oh, my fellow men and women, there's no need to be afraid anymore. Soon, your days of quarantine will all be over as the cure has been found. The government has failed you, but I am now your salvation. And it is my promise to all of you that I will mass produce a serum and start distributing the cures to each and every neighborhood until I make it across this entire country. Soon, we'll all be feeling this good again. And boy, does it sure feel good. And when all is said and done, let history show that this is the face of the first vaccination survivor. Huh?